My name is Corbin Painter. I am a junior and my majors are history, uh, Germanic studies, and I'm minoring in classics. I'm a big fan of interdisciplinary work, so I include a lot of like uh, German language stuff into my history studies, um, as well as like studying classics also has to do with history. I also uh, work a lot with women, gender, and sexuality studies, so they all complement one another. It allows me to examine a lot like deeper into what I'm researching if I know the language. For a while now, I've been working on a project with uh, the History Department Honors thesis. So I am looking at the lives of lesbian women under the National Socialist Regime in Germany. I am also working on a project with Professor Vancina in the German Studies Department over uh, queer theory and German literature in the 19th century. The way we think of a like a modern gay identity or a modern like lesbian identity was really formed in Germany um, at the end of the 19th century. The term homosexuality was coined in German. The Weimar Republic was actually Germany's first democracy, and it was the first democracy to allow women the right to vote even before the United States had. German citizens enjoyed uh, significantly more civil liberties than they did under the imperial regime. Under that regime, they faced the destruction of their their social connections. So previously in the Weimar period, they were able to organize at clubs and bars and they had their own publications. Once the National Socialist regime took over, they were banned from publishing their uh, like documents and their pamphlets and such, and they, their bars and clubs and organizations were closed. They were forced kind of back into the closet. I think it's very important that we study history and that way we can help build our own like individual and collective identities. Uh, we also can learn a lot from history. We learn what things we're doing right in society and what things we're doing wrong and our mistakes and we can learn from them hopefully.